Joe Great Gains and Alex here. <laughs> oh god. Alright, now I'm not listening to music. Now we're, we're gonna have to go full focus. Twitch chat, you're gonna have to tell me. What could I hit vibe with? Ooh, good Colossus map. Good Colossus map. Should I hit him with that hot colo that he's never seen? He's gonna say, these colo. Way too strong. Mine more minerals. Oh, crap, I was supposed to chrono. I always forget to chrono. Cannon rush him every single game. That would be good practice. That would be good practice. <sighs> I do wonder, do you think timings would hit faster with uh, Chrono? Right? If you Chrono to Gate or Twilight Council a lot, could that... Could that make your timings faster Whoa, need more than energy, before? Guy. If I tell you yes, will you believe me blindly? Follow me into the blind, or the follow me into the blind. That doesn't sound right. Need more energy. Follow me into the something. If I lose to vibe, how many of you guys are unsubscribing? I'm probably unsubscribed. Not only that, I'm going to change my subscription on Vibe channel to a tier 3 sub. Because look, I've been playing versus Pig, I've got all the inside deets on how to win. If I lose at this point, you know, I basically played more games of PTR than I played of Louder. Not enough minerals. I think this Vibe's going to hit me with the Swarm Host, I'm just, I'm instantly going to leave. If Vibe goes Swarm Host on me, I'm out. I'm going to say, look. You've activated the one thing that I you need more minerals. You do not know how to handle. Time. To be honest, me, Rab, look, I understand. Frankly, I understand. I get it. I get it more than anybody, really. We need more money. Uh, minerals. Mine more minerals. Not enough energy. I guess I should be my Stargate up here. Battery shield! Gemini. Twitch chat. Should we, should we? Every time Gemini corrects me from calling shield battery battery shield, does he deserve a 10 minute timeout? Yes or no? I mean, I'm basically here to change the name of it. Which I'm doing. Push battery shield sounds better. Shield battery, battery shield. Mm. Battery shield. I don't know, man. I mean, when you say people's names, right? Let's say you had a couple brothers. I mean, that doesn't really work for me because my brother's name is Mark, and people would say Mark and Chris. Should I go Mass Oracle? Battery shield set makes sense. All right. What what keyboard do I use? I don't know. Twitch chat, help me. I have a Rosier Chroma Stealth, and that's all I know. Does that help you? I think I'm gonna make a Void Ray. Makes sense in Spanish. Like lots more, all over. I'm supply block. Since when is a Void Ray for supply? You must construct Has a Void Ray always been for supply? You seek guidance and an Get! That's what you call an, effe an effective, uh. That's an effective boy right there. I'm gonna go call him. You have not enough minerals. Money, 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 money. You need more minerals. Not enough energy. How, how? Let's be honest, guys. How many nights are you guys gonna stay up crying? Need more energy. Um. 
when mo the mothership is gone from us. Not and she has you. truly left our presence. I mean, I've I've already spent up I've already stayed up a few nights crying, thinking about the mothership core leaving uh, leaving me. I guess I should use my revelation, it huh? I'm surprised I wasn't able to find anything. I feel like these colos are really late. But I don't want to say they're really late, because I'm just going to make it sound like I've messed up. I'm gonna build a battery shield. Now I'm gonna only call it a battery shield, frankly. That just feels right. Is that Festers or is that Swarm Host? You need more minerals. I don't know, but I don't like it. What's the strategy? This is my new mothership core. They basically replaced my old friend. And they gave me a new friend. And they named him Shield Battery. And they said, look, you better like this friend because it's what you, it's all you have. Ooh. Not enough <laughs> You're attacking your probes. Watch your mineral. They're going after your pylon. A classic tank. How much does he have here? I think he has burrowed faster, doesn't he? I'm not going in. I think he's got burrowed faster. This is like no units at all, but I'm like fairly certain. Bigger, faster, upgraded. You're out of supply. Mineral field depleted. He hasn't seen my colo yet. Whoa. Is he going for broods though? Like lots I really need to see where where his high tech is at. Not enough minerals. Our window is short. Oh, found a couple of friends. That field's been <laughs> it said balance test, okay? Oh my god! He's baited me with chat! Spend it all in one place. Aha. Alright, you guys think I can kill him? I really have done a whole lot of nothing in this game. You can't warp in there. Chop's done. Protoss need a Oh my god. Feels like he's gonna have broods. That would be honestly wicked toxic. The threads of fate lie bare. An omen. You seek guidance. Let us begin. Oh boy. 
We are the Knight of the Kala. Your probes are under attack. Get him out of there! I think this is okay for me, isn't it? Upgrade complete. <laughs> oh god, Colossus are buns. Take it from me, Colossus are buns. <laughs> By the Void Ray, uh, I don't know. I, I mean, honestly, without the Mothership Core, I felt like I needed a little damage. But, I don't really know. I don't know. Interesting. We're we're still learning, right? We're still learning. Okay. Okay. Now I need to I need to chat him up. That's where that's where I thrive when I'm able to distract with my voice. Okay. Hold on. Let me see. Let me see. Hmm. 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 Let's see. Oh, caps. Yeah. Colo and Ice. I actually, I've actually been going Colo on actual ladder, like non-patch. And I do think they're not that bad. I really don't. But I don't know if I should have gone to Colossus throughout I win, right? I went Stargate. Maybe a faster Colossus. I mean, most people don't play like Vibe and go Insta, Insta Hive, right? So. Streaming while well, the Super... That's true. The Super Tournament qualifiers are on right now, aren't they? Like, can I play in that, or is it too late? I think I've already missed my thing. Oh, yeah, they are on. You don't... Oh, wait, you... wait you... don't you have to be in Korea, though? Yeah, you have to be in Korea. Hmm. Yeah, they, they probably did that on purpose, so I couldn't show up. Why am I still subbed? Look, I have no idea. Frankly, I've unsubbed after that last game. I've unsubbed after that last game, man. I want up to myself, frankly. Where's my freaking Discord? Oh, here we are. I've made it. What's up, dude? <laughs> that fast hive. That wasn't fair. <laughs> <laughs> I think, uh... Yeah, I don't know. I heard you talking about Sky Toss. Yeah, mm. I, uh... I was just saying, since you can't, you still can't fungal air, right? In this shit? Mm, no, you can do it again. It's you can do it again. They changed okay, it back. But I All still right, think not... I don't know. I think that something about the new fungal it's it's bigger, right? It's a bigger radius. Yeah. So it doesn't seem like it. Does it not lock down units ever anymore though? No, yeah, it does. It, it's just it's just like a hefty slow. Yeah. Okay. I I don't know. I I literally faced a very similar thing with Pig. He went like Mass Roach and Fester. I mean, given I was on Colossus. Yeah. But I lost. I think, honestly, yeah. Infestors are pretty good against PvP. I mean, Immortal Charge Lot Storm is still going to be okay against it. But, I, like, Disruptors... I tried to go Disruptors against that Infestor play, and you can't. Like, I... like yeah, no, So, Infestors are pretty good again, I feel. I love Infestors, man. I love Infestors <laughs> before, and I love them after. Yeah, I think they're still they're pretty... They're, like, the best unit you can use in the house. Yeah, I think they're good. I, honestly, I... The Battery Shield is not bad. I I don't know. It's like horrible, but it's also great. It has both ends. Cuz it is is yeah. 75 minerals. But Yeah, it's interesting. I don't know, it's like minerals. Uh every time I see a Protoss battery shield, the only time I've ever seen it do good or do well is if like the Protoss opened up gateway heavy or something and they're defending their natural or something like that and it's like oh my my little harass is now being countered by the fact that you have just like tons of shields. Yeah. But I feel like it makes it a lot harder for you to take a third now. And it also makes it really easy for me to siege you. Because yeah. it doesn't actually do anything offensive. It's just like absorbing damage, you know? Yeah, that's fair. And it, if, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, just, no, I agree. I, I feel like all ends are going to be strong. Yeah. 
I think uh, I, I agree with that. I mean, I don't know. They are strong, but you do not have to make the mothership part, right? So you save 100 gas early game, and you save 100 minerals. And, I mean, the biggest thing with Protoss that Pig said as well was, like, especially, it's more versus Terran, but kind of versus Zerg as well, where Protoss kind of, like, goes on a three base with, like, a Zealot and a Stalker, right, and a mothership core. Right, so now if you have to produce gateway units, you're slowing everything down because you can't really expand until you have gateway units. Because like you, yeah. Protosses are used to taking bases with like one unit and just like waiting to make units. So it's definitely going to be different. Are you ready? So yeah. to talk and play? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm good, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I feel like a lot of times uh, against Protoss now, it's almost required to either make a Roach Warren or get drop Lords for Banelings because I feel like you're going to see Sentry pushes as well. Yeah, I think Sentries could be okay. Well, like essentially pushes with like harassing a mineral line and then just recalling out while your force fields are still there. Yeah. And even if the Zerg has Ravager, you can still throw down a force field and recall before the Ravager can mm. hit you. Mm. Yeah. Good luck. I mean, the thing about the recall is, it's good. I I kind of for always forget about it. Honestly, I keep forgetting that I have a recall. But yeah. It it it's it's much better to defend bases than to fall back from, because it's really long it's like four or five seconds like if you try to recall yeah, yeah. you like lose your entire army if they're on no, you that's, I, that's why i think it only works if you have centuries involved like if you do if you were to do something like warpism a zerg and have yeah. like two centuries and an immortal litter or something like that and you just warp in like around a charge box and kill them additional and you just, if you work in one more century yeah it could be good you force field in the fucking ramp and you just oh man's dead recall we need more yeah, that's true i mean the thing actually I, I gotta look okay yeah the cooldown's pretty long it's 130 it's seconds. Oh, 130. Okay. Yeah, I wasn't. I didn't realize there was a cooldown, so I was trying to make plays where I was like going across the map and then like recalling, and then like I went across the map again. I didn't have recall. I mean, 130 is what over a little over two minutes. Just over two minutes. Yeah. It's not crazy long, but it's. I don't know. We playing. We were playing Ascension, and I pushed to the top right, and I recalled, and I pushed to the top right again, and I did not have recall a second time. So, it's like long, but also short. I think, uh, we yeah, PVZ, the else. thing about PVZ is I feel like it didn't change a whole lot, because Hydras and Banelings are still the same. Yeah. From the Zerg side, you guys didn't really change very much. Depends how you play, I guess. Like, the, the standard meta Zerg, who just Hydras and Banes every game, I feel like it's pretty similar to that now. Yeah. But if you, if you, I feel like Hydras and Banes has a clock, energy. though. Where if the Protoss gets to a point where they max and they have like a solid you need army, more minerals. I don't think my die day, we might yeah, it can be hard. Not it depends what type of Hydra Bane it is, I think. Sometimes I'd still get wrecked by Hydra Bane, but yeah, the longer the game goes, the Protoss army gets stronger. But yeah, I, I, have you faced a lot of the Master Oracle build? Not on this. Yeah, not on PTR. I just gotta say, I've only faced one Master's Protoss on this. Yeah. Every time I play, it's like yeah, it's I'm horrible. Queue. Four minutes and it's like a platinum player or something. Yeah. Yeah, this horrible queue. I still have to. I literally every time my warp gate finish or my, my cybernetic core finishes, I press M to make a mothership core. I can't yeah. do it. Not enough energy. I do wonder if timings could be good again because Chrono is like really like you get a ton off your Chrono now. I also think Colossus could still be okay, but I don't know if they're. I don't think they're good versus Infestors really. They're horrible versus Ultras, obviously. They might have been okay. They might be okay versus Infestor. Yeah. I honestly have a hard time getting to the Infestor now because of whatever re like honestly when people used to be on Infestors I'd go Disruptors because I could just Disruptor the Infestor but now that I can't Disruptor the Infestor I honestly don't have a great answer to them yeah no, I, don't, I don't know uh, I, I don't know but like I, I think Sky Toss is uh, like obviously it's not an answer right away yeah. it will still be good like the, ultimate of the, game the late game transition will still be strong yeah 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 PvP is pretty screwed now, but it's alright, I guess. Because, like, right now I've played a few TV PvPs, and the battery shield doesn't save, like, two adepts hurting you, so you just kind of get, I don't know, it's it's, a, it's like it's like ZVZ, where you just can, like, early rush people now. It's gross. Yeah, the thing about battery shield that has its limitations is okay. It's technically called shield battery, but I always call it battery shield. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> uh, yeah, Gemini's giving me crap, but the, I think that it, it's like it honestly does an okay job at defending, but it is like a really limited area, right? If you can get around it, then I'm kind of screwed. But 
I don't know. I've been playing around with it. And I used, like, sometimes I'm like, man, battery shield's actually pretty fun. But sometimes it's like, man, battery shield. Research finished. It just is weird. I think you are right about the taking expansion is going to be a lot harder. Like, just heavy lane floods are going to be. Yeah. Like, you could be on 40 drones. Them. You can't use a battery shield. Yeah. It's going to be like, it's going to be how it was in Wings of Liberty when, uh, Protoss is at it. Like, you two base all in a lot because you struggle to take a third circus flying aggressive. Yeah. Not yeah, kind of. Oh my god, what am I seeing coming across the map here? Make more pylons. I'm here in the shadows. I don't know if this defense is gonna be any good. We require more minerals. Oh god. You need more minerals. In my day we mined eight minerals at a time. Well, that was a good use of a better shield. more pylons. Like Whoa, we need more energy. Oh my god. Can you come back in like a, like two or three minutes? It's kinda busy right now. I'm trying to macro up. Mm, this looks scary, I'm not gonna lie to you. Oh my god, I lost my warp in there. Really using overcharge right now. Oh! <laughs> oh! Didn't need you to do that. I really wanted to see you, show you what the Raptor would do there. Spoiler alert. Upgrade complete. Hmm. You require my skill. Quite the attack. I mean, it's it's long, but it's not. Eh, I, I was able to get out at least. You can't warp in there. I'm here in the shadows. I've been talking to you, by the way, and my mic's, uh, I haven't pushed talk on right now, so I have not, not talked to you. Energy. <laughs> it's okay. I thought you were, uh, getting a little nervous. It's alright. <laughs> <laughs> you must place that. Consciousness awakened. Yeah, I was just saying, uh, the recall, it's, I feel like everything is really scary. For you, as for us, as Banelings, Banelings would just wreck you. Yeah, that would've. Also, probably if you just had you more stuff, you would've been in a good, okay spot. Yeah, yeah. He's been trash talking me. I believe it, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> Are you kidding me with this? Right, I'm about to. I'm about to show you new school Protoss right here. So, you think these mutes are gonna do anything? You got another thing coming. That's it. You're gonna wish Protoss never got this new item. <laughs> That you can't warp in there. You can't touch them, they got battery shield. You can't warp in there. Okay, maybe you can touch them. I mean it heals to an extent. Now they're at energy. <laughs> this 
this that bad for me? Uh, they're attacking your base, you know. I think this is a oh, whoa. Look at the battery shield going in! <laughs> Look at how useless disruptors are. I hate this unit. Oh my god. Jesus. Honestly, their disruptors are horrible. They're at, they're at, like, I'm going to go to a museum in a year and I'm going to see the disruptor there as something that was is now extinct. They're actually... So, it shoots three seconds faster, but if, if it ever come in, comes in contact with something in the middle, watch. If it hits something in the middle, it insta-detonates. Oh, yeah, that's right. I remember that. So, like, remember, yeah. you, you, like, I'll just try to hit your, something in the back and then the... Uh, yeah. we have attack. The, ling the lings will just get me. No, it's alright. I think this is... If I had a disruptor shot here, maybe? Okay. <laughs> just get my own stalkers there. <laughs> Look, I want to say the disruptor is going to be good, but I, I, don't, I don't... The thing is, the stalkers should be stronger, because they do more damage now, yeah, per shot. They attack slower, but... Yeah, you can kind of wreck... Yeah. I don't know. I wonder if the shield batteries are up in time. Like, I wonder if mutas aren't that scary to my base. You need more minerals. In my day, we mined eight minerals. They probably are. <laughs> They're still mutas. Yeah, I guess I didn't even say it. Yeah. In the low numbers, it'd be pretty good, but. Give me a chance when you get killed. Me, let me have all your lings there. That's friendly of you. You can't warp in there. I'm sacrificing my probes. Uh, they're attacking your base, you, know. you wouldn't have that base in the uh, the one that I killed earlier, right? That's probably gone. Just tell me it's gone. Thank you. Oh Christ! See, I'm instantly back. So it's like, it's like okay on the recall home, because you are instantly home. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like I uh, it, stalkers are fucking way scarier than I uh, expected. So yeah. I should have. Uh, I feel like I should have focused more on like if I'm gonna do what I'm doing now, I'm gonna link. I should have gone heavier on Ling with Hive and getting Adrenal, I think. Yeah, I also think Infestors are really good for Stalker still. Even though you don't completely stun them now, they're still good. Can you still bleak if you get fungal now? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, you can. But they're like still slowed. Yeah, yeah. Your base is under attack again. I don't know. I, I think I might have could have won if I didn't go Disruptor, maybe. <laughs> that didn't give me much value going into Disruptor attack. But when did you yeah, yeah, I think you probably could have as well. Like, I think you still could win right now. Yeah, it's not over. I could. Uh, Would have been in a better spot. I can't really fight your army. Your army's kind of scary. And I had that insta recall now. I guess I never am like super screwed if I don't know. You can't just snipe Mothership Core and end the game on me now, I guess. Yeah, yeah. That's actually pretty good. Yeah. They're attacking your probes. Watch your mineral line. Honestly, these little battery shields have been okay. Not enough mineral. Not crazy good, but. Probes are under attack. Hmm. Uh, can they heal buildings or no? No, just okay. units. I was gonna say that's actually gonna be so fucking annoying if you can battery shield buildings. Base yeah. range yeah. Your base are attack, man. <laughs> Mass battery shield on each other. <laughs> 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 Oh, they can heal buildings? Chat's telling me they can heal buildings, so now I've just lied to you. Okay. 
But you have to manually target them on buildings. Oh, okay, so that is actually kind of annoying. Except cannons, they get auto healed. Hmm. I'm learning things. Unless Twitch just lying to me, which is 50 50 at this point. Yeah, I think I'm in a good spot all of a sudden. You just made a lot of units here. What's that about? I don't know. I, made, I made what I could. You require my and they're gonna die before they spawn. Oh my god. Is the boy. I am the voice. Yeah, I think I'm dead. We're gonna have one last battle, but. Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, that was only half my army there. You require my. <laughs> we are. I am the voice of the. We are. Cold. Yeah, maybe the new recall is actually pretty good. I, I'm looking for it's. Uh, I got a base at the uh, middle, a little more to the right. It's uh, a little bit fortified. You require my. You need more minerals. Got a few battery shields. Oh no. Yeah, there's no way. You like do, do stalkers? You just. I just want to see what this looks like, actually. The thing is, yeah, stalkers are actually wicked versus there now, kind of. Uh, yeah, like the battery shield wasn't even helping them because it's a kind of a small circle the battery shield has. Yeah. Did you? Did you? you require more. I don't know. That's the crazy. That's the thing about this, right? Is like we neither of us know what we're doing or anything. We know anything really. <laughs> yeah, I kind of overestimated me as man. Oh my god, I, the stalker is actually way scarier than I. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually didn't even think about that either. That the stalkers would be that good at this, at dealing with like. Air, because I know stalkers are really good versus liberators in low numbers, and medvacs. Like I can like kill a medvac in like four shots now. It's like really, it's insane. So yeah, stalk stalkers could yeah. be th interesting. Wait, can you actually kill a like with one stalker? I don't know the exact number on it, but it's okay, yeah. it's Just less. Like, like, small group. It, uh, stalkers are worse from what I feel like the stalkers are worse in large number, like versus large liberator counts because they attack so much slower. I've been blinking in, and I've been trying to snipe, like, because usually I could blink in, maybe snipe two or three, fall back. But now, like, I snipe okay. one, and I, like, I, like, misclick my next shot because it's not the same timing anymore. And I, like, it take a ton of damage. It's, it's a little worse. It's eight shots for a medvac instead of 12 now. That's a huge, pretty huge difference. Okay, yeah. That's, yeah. Because they do, what, like, 20 damage now or something, or 18? Yeah, it's, it's, it's a lot more. But I still think, I think right now with Zerg, I mean, you could still easily go, like, Hydra Bane. But I do think Infestors are still good. I think Swarmosts are good. I th they changed Swarmosts a little bit, I think. Yeah, oh, they're slow uh, off creep. I, yeah, last time I read it, it's just they're slow off creep. Yeah. That like, actually is kind of something. They can't escape as easier. Yeah. That could be good. I don't know. I have a hard time with Swarmosts, though. Like, la first game we played, I saw your Infestation Pit, and I was like, Jesus Christ, Swarmhost. And then it was <laughs> Infestors, and I was like, oh, I'm set. And then I still got <laughs> destroyed. <laughs> All right. You want uh, to play one or two more? You, uh, you can go play pubs. Oh, don't feel like I'm holding yeah. you. No, let's do it, man. That's, I'm actually having fun. Yeah. It's, uh, it's fun being on Skype. We, you can get Nero in here if you want. If he wants to talk, I don't really care. Oh, yeah, I don't mind. Uh, any, anyone can come, really. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, no, just, like, playing this with, you know. With someone, for sure. Yeah, but queuing it's like, yeah, whatever. But yeah, playing it and, like, worse. actually getting experience, like, a higher high level game is pretty fun. Yeah, and talking, and just, like, theory crafting with someone else that, you know, you can kind of piece things together with each other. Like when, I, like, cause I like Pig was kind of good, cause I think Pig's probably played the most out of like anybody, or at least near the most. He's played a lot of PTR, and uh, yeah, he, cause he play, he's been playing all the races, so I feel like he knows quite a bit. Um, I do think he think he also thinks Protoss is kind of weak right now, just like without like, he thinks the shield battery. Like right now, the consensus on the shield battery is, and Drogo said this is it's like it's like not that good in the early game, but it's like almost too strong in the mid to late game. Like okay. what's happening is you can you can kind of go mass carrier and then use like shield battery to pr to protect your carriers. Some it's uh, like some crazy things that pop up now with shield battery. So <laughs> yeah, no, I I I could see it. Can you get knobs? You can Protoss, come and watch Gemini if you want. Protoss just gets like insane. The 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 more you have, the stronger the army gets because like the death ball grows. You yeah. Know, and the death ball just has more output. I mean, but... they did nerf the carrier a little bit. The interceptors are five more. Which, you know, who knows how much it's really going to affect. Because I do think about this, okay? I know you, you, all the Zergs hate carriers, and I do enjoy massing carriers. So, you know, take this for what it is. But I, it wasn't that long ago 
where carriers were never used. Okay, carriers, yeah. there, and that was when carriers were 25 minerals per, they were never used. Now, yeah. they also added the auto interceptor, which is kind of a big thing, right? Like every time, it used to, you have to manually right click and make interceptors every time a carrier popped out, and now it auto produces, which is a huge lifesaver. Um, mm. But, I mean, then again, back then, Tempest were just better, a better choice than the carriers, so hard to know exactly. Yeah. But. To be honest, I love it when Protoss go carrier. I don't mind carrier. Yeah. I, uh, I, I, I think it best just really, really good against Yeah. Me. Yeah. It's kind of hard to deal with Mass Neural. I will say, uh, I will say, I think, when I go Sky Toss, I like, I'll always go Sky Toss pretty much on Acolyte, because it's just like, you're asking me to go Sky Toss. And on Acolyte, like, I either run in, just in general, I go Sky Toss, I either run into players who know how to beat me and I just get destroyed, or players who don't know how to beat Sky Toss and I destroy them. I don't really have a ton of close games. Like, I either they either know what they're doing and I lose, or I they don't know what they're doing and I just easily win. <laughs> yeah, I know. I've, I've played Protoss and I've experienced the same thing. <laughs> There's someone who, like, doesn't know what's really going on, they just run into it and, like, oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Good luck. The early game is kind of weird now with Protoss. Like, you chrono, like, you could either chrono instantly and your timings are a little... Like your net, you're, you like get supply blocked for a second, or you don't chrono and wait till after. I'm not sure what's better. I, I don't know. It's kind of weird now because you, uh, you start with 50 I energy. Not yeah, yeah, I think it's after because uh, that's how it was before too. You would never chrono before the before pylon. it was, yeah. Because the supply block was just like too much of a waste. Yeah, I think. I guess I'll go gate first because if you go early lings, I don't want to. Because if I was on Nexus first and you went early lings, then it'd be even. Wouldn't be the best judgment on how hard, how strong it would be because I would already be on Nexus. We need more money. Need more I'm gonna do a, another build this game. Yeah, you can do it. You can do anything. Done. And, and I'm, I think I think this will be really strong. Need more energy. Okay. <laughs> for like for like controlling the game basically. Yeah. Okay. Honestly, I've been going Col on Korea. I've been going Colossus some some success. Like I've been beating some players who are my level and blower below, but like players who are higher MMR than me always crash me when I'm on Colo. Like in the current meta, Dude, I've been doing colo. Do you actually find like decent games on Korea for like the PTR? Or uh, PTR? no, 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 not PTR. I, I was, I'm just talking straight ladder. Uh, okay. <clears throat> oh, jeez, I love you it. You can't warp in there. <laughs> I, I literally, I, it's like my good luck have fun. I, I like auto do it every game, whether I'm thinking about it or not. I'm doing so much. I had. I guess I had GG. <laughs> There's a couple sprays I like, but then the cheese just seems so fitting. People, I get in their head a little bit. You need more yeah, minerals. Yeah, yeah. In my day, we mined eight minerals at a time. Whoa! You need more yeah, I think Colossus could become more popular in PVZ again because they did nerf. See, the thing is, they made him better versus light, which is what Hydra Bane. I don't really know everything. Like, what's what's light? What's heavy? What's light whatever. Is not, uh, light is not light. Is Ling Hydra energy? Okay. So yeah, that's honestly it. Ooh, also, Pig was telling me the lurkers are kind of good now. Late game lurkers. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He said they move around like insta warp morping hell bats and stuff. They're like, they're okay. They're not bad. I don't know. I mean, when you're on lurkers on hive tech, you know, you could, you kind of just like, well, maybe it'd be better if I was on something else. Right? It's like I could be on I, yeah, ultras no. or broods or you something else. Yeah, it depends what you're fighting against, I guess. If you're, if you're fighting against anything that has siege involved, that has better siege than lurker, I would never yeah. want to go lurker. Because it just you feels like a minerals. losing battle. In my yeah. day, we mined eight minerals at the time. Oh, Christ. Oh, yeah. Something I'll tell you as well that Pig reminded me of was now that we don't have a mothership core, your overlords can be very annoying again. Unless I'm going Stargate, you can sit on those nooks again because I can't see. I can't spot. Yeah, right, yeah, like yeah. you could be on that nook right outside my natural, and I wouldn't be able to spot yeah, it anymore. We require more like... Wait a minute here. <laughs> oh yeah, baby! <laughs> I win soccer first by action. It's supposed to be an adept. It's gonna pay off for me, isn't it? I guess it's gonna pay off either way because I'm making a Stargate. Wouldn't really matter. I think I'm gonna make it out. But here, yeah, your Stargate will see it. Oh! oh! It lives! I had faith. I had faith. <laughs> You may even realize this, but I'm already running away. I won't even be there when I start getting pops. <laughs> I, I wonder if, like, it's going to be common to, like, either go sentry openers or, like, adepts and stuff now. Because, like, if you do need more units to take a third, adept, like, heavy adept might be more common again. I think sentry openers will be really common again. I don't know. I don't really feel like sentries are that good anymore. In, like, just, like, in general. 
because when I think about centuries, I think you're so you're wait you're spending so much gas on that that like it is just like centuries will be good would be okay because you could transition to cola with them. But I don't know. I don't really think sentries are that strong of an opener because then I feel like I, I fall behind on attack. I think sentries just coincide well with pressure with recall as well yeah, as yeah, I, yeah. Good yeah, I mean I can see it, but I can also see. Yeah, I don't know. Like that's why I also have a hard time thinking the Colossus is going to be good again because yeah, yeah, yeah. I like the reason I thought the Colossus was good at, ever was because force fields. Like, the Colossus by itself was never, like, Colossus Wing Stalker was kind of a thing, but really, Colossus was kind of carried by the, by its century, the century. And uh, the century is just not really a big part of the meta right now, so, okay. <laughs> it's not that bad, maybe. Well, maybe it is. See, you committed a lot to this, so I might be. Oh no! Like lots more, all over. Well, it was not that bad. Now I'm. I wouldn't mind. Oh god. You can't warp in there. Getting a mulligan for that one. more minerals. We're good. The thing is, at that exact moment, even a mothership core wouldn't have saved me at that third. So. Also, these plus one. That's not gonna change what I'm doing at all. Interesting. Thank you for the information. <laughs> it's, a, it's a test. We're all learning. <laughs> Please don't come back to my third. Trying to get up a good economy. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I got the cheese down though. That's gonna really help me macro up into that that little that cheese ball I got down there. Honestly, yeah, it, it's like it's interesting because I do think a couple battery shields honestly makes my third pretty pretty decent. Well, we're gonna find out, aren't we? You need more oh my god! In my day, we mined eight minerals at a time. Oh lordy! I think this is still fine for me, actually. You can't go to town. You can't warp in there. That feels good. Mm. See, now this is good. Now my battery shield's done. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I can heal my buildings. I have to auto select it. That will be interesting as well. That is good. I was wondering if you could do that. That's Yeah. The thing is, especially when it's just finished, it really doesn't have much energy on it. Actually, let me see. Does it, does it heal like three, three shield? Holy moly. Energy? Yeah, so I just used my entire energy, but it took it from 220 to 480. That's pretty, that's kind of big. Shield wise. It took my Nexus from 220 to 480. Yeah. Not enough it's not, minerals. it's definitely not bad. Honestly, when it's healing units though, it does, once it drains, then it's, it's drained. Down. The issue is, I don't know what you're doing. Any uh, Anything you want to share with me? Uh, <laughs> you're natural. Oh! oh they have a wall. That's a new school cool Colossus right there. Oh, God. Scary. Remember, can't go Mutas anymore. That needs a power I got, sto I got the, the deadly stalkers now. Oh, this is a different game. Alright, I'm gonna come across the map and scout, so don't try to hide anything from me. I'm gonna see it. Hmm. That feels see nothing. You must place that in a power shield. Oh really, you're going for this? At this time? It's not gonna work. I would change decks. <laughs> yeah. Oh no! <laughs> Again. That is a lot of links. You definitely have Hive and Infestors with this. And I don't like it one bit. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, yeah. I mean, if I could just start learning to recall. Like, I got. I think I gotta start abusing recall more. I just forget I have it. Honestly. It's not very Protoss-like of me. Honestly, the recall seems pretty decent, too. It kind of bailed me out in that muta base trade. Oh! What's going on? Oh, you recall? <laughs> I was trying to, yeah. What if they're full of banelings? That would not be. That would be really... <laughs> that would not be cool. I think this is good! You're gonna drop banelings. I know it. Yeah, this is starting to look good for me. Yeah, I literally, I was just pushing out and I luckily found you there. Try that again. I like I like what you did there. No. <laughs> you seek God. You can't warp in there. Honestly, like cannons and battery shields seem really strong at defending bases. Like new, yeah, those new bases yeah. I'm taking. I don't give enough credit. It honestly is like really well. That's a, I do think late game it don't, it might be too strong. I mean, it's so early to tell. Right? No, neither of us can really know that, but it does seem really good. It seems like like cannons are like you know they're they're cannons. They're ca but they're kind of not as scary as battery shield. I'm just gonna try to shut the space down if you don't mind. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Mineral field depleted. Do you have ultras here or no? Hey, your base is I under attack. It's a trap. I don't have blank, so I can't see if I can blink or not. Your head of ones died after you recalled. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to the fungal. And and our mind. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about that. It's like We are we are seeing and you're ahead right now though. Yeah, so that was still specific. good for me. That's great. I do like your composition, but I think you probably would have been ahead if that I didn't push out and run into your drop like that. Yeah, they were plus two melee links, and I was gonna try and wreck your uh, it's like kill a command or a nexus really? before you recall to it because of the four seconds. I don't know. I wonder if you actually we're running out of minerals times. back home. Hmm, would have been close, but then like the recall is 130 seconds, right? So if you did that and you had pressure on my my fourth base, it would have been really good. Yeah, yeah exactly. I had a another group outside. Yeah. So then you push them just fucking on my lanes pretty hard. Yeah, I did. The battery, I do think battery shield cannon is kind of like impossible to break. You need, it banelings I guess would be good. Yeah, yeah. Oh. 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 Nothing. Don't mind what I just did there. Take it that I, I'm up, I'm up to every, per, I'm doing everything perfectly normal. It's a normal game of StarCraft. I am definitely not up to. Whoa! <laughs> Had no energy. Max supply. When your units sit around the house, they sit around the house. Not a big fan of what's going on here. You're at max supply. Oh my god. Upgrade complete. We embrace the glory. Wow, you're capped out. Time to make. We're running out of minerals. Back home. Like for fire. You're at max supply. Protoss need a power. Nobody's perfect. I like for fire. We just come. 
You're maxed out. Good job. Oops. We meet our fate. Need more and No! We are the light of the Cosmos. You can't warp in there. It's the darkness. Our forces are under attack. Your pylon is under attack. Help me. Hmm. Hmm. No. Don't. Nope. Yeah. Go back. I'm not really. I'm kind of weak on that south side. So if you could just stick to these top two, thank you. Maxed out. Good job. Never skipping leg day. Justice has come. That field's been mined out. Hope you have an expansion. Vespian guys are exhausted. We embrace the glory of battle. Really? Really? Are you map hopping? Whoa! I'm not a fan of that, what you're doing there. From the shadows I come. I guess you not might might not be the biggest fan of me either. Come on. Don't you dare neuroparasite me. Don't do it! When your units sit around, guys are empty. He's upon us. Hey, your base is under attack, man. We're running out of your probes. Stop are under that. Attack. I command you to stop that. From the shadows, I come. You stop it. With your pistol. That is upon us. We are Bigger, faster, stronger, upgraded. Hey, your base is under attack. It's a trap. It's fine. Those units were horrible workers for me anyway. You can't warp in there. The Gotta say, not a big fan of what you're doing down there. Oh my! Uh, they're attacking your base, you know. <laughs> <laughs> you got a lot of ultras. I can't tell if this is good or bad for you. I think it's bad for you. You need to leave my main base. We're running out of minerals back home. Whoa. They're going after your pylon. No. Oh. <laughs> you were way too close to that. Don't, don't run, dude. <laughs> Not enough energy. Also use some donations. <laughs> I honestly probably would have thrown away my thrown away a lead there if I uh, you didn't tell me you were broke. I was gonna keep charging with the carriers. Thank you for that tip. <laughs> I literally do that so much. I'm like, man, I just won that fight with these carriers. Let me just keep pushing on and then I just throw it away. I really wanted to make that mothership. She she had room to impress me. Now I think I'm gonna win. Maybe. Yeah, I think you are. You're mining on like. Oh, I actually Enough. Don't have space. Yeah, you're in trouble. I got hit bases on the top right. You didn't even notice. <laughs> I'm going to check now. You've got in my head. <laughs> Watch out, there's Infester. I'm gonna. Oh my god, I hit the drone. What? 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 You don't see me? <laughs> Geyser's empty. I'm sending two DTs to your top score caller right now, FYI. Or am I? I I just forgot if I was or not now. 
I might. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Who's broke now, huh? <laughs> I think I only lost. I don't know how many. That was actually sick, though. I was like, where is this Nidus worm? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Joke's on you, I'm going Sky Toss, you've already lost. I think, I, well, with, since the fungal is actually how it was before, I, I don't think I should have to rely on this like ultra style play. Yeah. Hey, I wasn't lying, I told you I told you to look out for that in your main. I'm gonna rally two more up there on, this, on uh, more of your main buildings in case you don't take care of it in time. Hey, nice army on the bottom, I see it. <laughs> don't think I don't see that shit. We need more money. I see a lot of ultras in the main base. Yeah, but there's not much I can do. Yeah, I know. Yeah, you just That's don't know. Takes, right? Seven ultras to kill a 2 Yep. Yeah. <laughs> this is that point of that game where it's like, it looks like I'm doing things, but I actually just have more stuff and there's nothing you can do. I uh, can't stank around for dinner, man. I'm sorry. Gotta go. The thing is, oh no, I'm being dumb. I was gonna say you can only recall to your main base, but that's not true. I'm just have them all selected. Yeah, I'm I'm mousing up void rays right now, so best of luck to you. I wouldn't call three void rays, or maybe even less than this. I'm not gonna say if you win this game, I'm gonna be a little bit triggered, but I will be. You have like you have like one void ray. I got let me see. I got three void rays and one, two, three, five carriers. I got the skin in the bag. <laughs> oh, God. We're out of Where, uh, what are those corruptors doing? Done. Just curious. I'm going to use some abilities in the patch on the zealots. Oh, right. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I got an army coming over here. Are you? Do you have any infestors anywhere near me? Oh. No. No. You probably should have warned me about that. I'm not going to lie to you. It's pretty low. That was terrain. <laughs> That's a warning shot. Wait a minute. Hey, you want a warning shot? I'll fucking give you a warning shot. No! I feedbacked him first. That's right. Nobody feedbacks my own high templars. They get a little sick and you fucking feedback them to death? Nobody feedbacks my own high temps. Hey, come to the watchtower. I got, I got a, I'm building a bit of a wall in the middle of the map. Just come to the middle, come to the middle watchtower. See what's up. Empty. Got some cheese. Got, got a wall of cheese right there. <laughs> Put the got the mid-game cheese going right in the middle. Absolutely not. I've seen how this played out. Oh yeah. What's your army composition like? How do you not have either of these bases on the south and expect to win? Riddle me that. You know what? Get ready. Your mind to be blown. If you win this game, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> this this game could single-handedly put me into retirement. <laughs> hey, have you ever heard of the uh, the Rocky Zone? Right? It's coming out of retirement. <laughs> I just don't fucking die. Oh okay, okay, god. I'm, I'm just gonna get more. What's your uh, what's your supply at? I got 134 army supply. You anywhere near there? 200. <laughs> Oh, that's nice. I think you're I at about like 135. That's where I think you're at. No, oh, you're overestimating me. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I've been just, You were really close to breaking me in that one fight when I almost lost all my carriers. I went down to like 110 supply, 100 supply. But now I've built an army that you are not. You're gonna be pretty sick, sick about. I'm not gonna lie. Longest game ever to someone in the chat. This is one of those games where. I'm at such a good spot, I don't really want it to end, because I know there's only one good outcome for me here. Gods have been stacked worse for me before. <laughs> oh god. I, I'm not gonna say I haven't thrown before. The show up, let everything get neural parasite. It's possible because... Yeah, it's possible for everything to get neural parasite. Now I'm gonna get an oracle, because you've, you've actually spooked me. I would like to make uh, corruptors, but you killed my spire. I can't build another one. I don't have enough money to You want me to go outside for a little bit, give you some time to build that spire up? <laughs> yeah. Let me, uh, let me just have a few minutes. 
You don't have either base on the south side. Now I'm getting angry that you haven't retaken those bases. I can't defend them. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, I got, I got, a, I got a bit of an. No, wait, wait, wait. Mom's not here yet. I gotta go back. As soon as she gets here, I'll come back over. You've got a handful of infestors there. Oh, you got Investor Viper! Why do I feel like I'm throwing? Oh my god, that's so much damage! Give me some time. Fall back. Fall back. Oh god! Oh! Oh! That tentacle? That fucking Investor tentacle was like a mile long. Ah. I think that was good for me, but now you've now you've thoroughly scared me. My, my supply went from 130 to 131 somehow. But I don't yeah, uh, same, same. <laughs> I'm actually over 200 supply now. It's just, I don't know what happened. I think I hosted the wrong server. <laughs> I forgot the new Viper does triple the damage of the old Viper. So yeah. You can't stack it anymore, but it does uh, way more damage. I think I could have ended this game a while ago, and now I think I have the potential to throw. My arm is still good. These fungals! Yeah, Chris, just clump everything up. Really strong. I think it's just not enough, though. Or is it? Oh my god, what's going on? Oh god! Not enough energy. Oh my god. Oh my god, you have so much! What would you ask of us? Holy Tell me you're broke. Tell me you're broke. Say say Chris I'm broke. I got a lot of money. Dude, I somehow I'm richer than I was before. I got paid for that fight. <laughs> you know, I had no observers. All of a sudden, I saw I, I was I was trying to look for an observer. I noticed I had no observers, and I was like, "Good Christ, I'm gonna get nerled to death here." You think I just threw it? Nope. This is a this is a calculated lead change. Is what it is. I said, you know what? It's it's more enjoyable to not have the lead. I think you're still screwed. What you just did there? Not enough best to kill all my fucking drones. I still have an economy. I'm not. I'm. Yeah. I'm gonna say though, my supply went from maxed to under a hundred. So I don't know what supply. What's where you at? I was 130 when I bought you. Well, that was. Looks like Sky Toss is absolute butt cheeks now. Oh my god. Geysers empty. Yeah, violin. Let's go. Almost though. I was just too ahead. I mean, if you kept all the festers alive, you almost had that. Like I was, I was at like a spot where I legitimately thought I could never lose that game, and then, boy, I almost no, lost yeah, it. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I think actually just going Hydra and Fester is still gonna work, because, not the fact that you can't fungal air and stick it in place like how you could before. Yeah. It's not that big of a deal because now the fungal's bigger and you still move so fast. And the slow. viper was doing yeah. a ton of damage, I think. No, yeah, exactly. Yeah, no, if I throw a parasitic bomb in there. Oh yeah. Even if they don't stack, I can throw in the clumps of where you split. So I can throw three like three bombs into like three clumps that you split apart. Yeah. And it just fucking does so much damage. I mean, I wasn't to be fair, I wasn't splitting well at all. I was I was kinda anti splitting. I was super clumped. <laughs> but yeah, that was something. I mean, to to be facing. I mean, I had some ground, but not much. I had like Archon Storm, so it was like kind of the ground I wanted, versus supply that was. Usually, when Sky Toss has that much more supply, it's not even close. But that was pretty close. Something yeah, about yeah. this new fungal. I the damage I don't think has changed. I think it's just bigger yeah, AOE. Yeah, no, they increased the radius by like one range. Yeah, it so. it feels strong now. I don't know what it is. It feels really good. Yeah, it's really easy to get your whole army in a fungal. Yeah. Plus, like a big ass clump of it. yeah, honest, yeah, yeah. Honestly, I don't know the best way to deal with infestors besides carriers because 
You can kind of get the High Templar from deep now with the Fester. I mean, you can't lock it down, but just like one or two, one or two fungals. And then, yeah. if Disruptors can't kill Infestors, Infestors should kind of do range supreme almost. I don't know. I do I like think the link, the link flood definitely on my third was pretty annoying, especially if I didn't open Oracle, I would have been in more trouble. Yeah, I I think going for like the melee upgrade was kind of like not needed. Yeah, probably not. Because I feel like I had so like, the first time I denied it, it was like literally no defense. You had a pile of yeah. and they got canceled. Yeah, well my void rate was at the south, but yeah, I don't think I would have been able to just hold it I anyway. Think. But committing to it, you actually. Uh, you defended, even though I had bait, like I made six banes and I attacked you with about 50 lings and yeah. you still defended your, your base. That yeah. oracle just fucking wrecked. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, the first one was put your head if you followed up with drones, but then the follow-up attack probably made it more even. Yeah. All right. You know, I'll play one more. Yeah, I'll play one more. I'm, I'm, I have been enjoying this a lot more than the latter right now, <laughs> i tell you. No, yeah, same. I, I'm ready for, like, some... Something new. Meta. Yeah. yeah. Cause like, I I have been, uh... Yeah. Like, the other day I played with Pig for, like, like about this time. And then, like, Pig left, and then, like, I just didn't even want to play anymore. <laughs> Cause I was like, alright. <laughs> no, it's, it's fun, man. Like, having a, a like, quote-unquote new game. Yeah, that's right. Kind of what it'll become, just like, something like, fresh. Awesome, yeah. Even if you I'm can, scared. You can actually learn shit and, like, think about stuff, and not just, like, copy-paste the same build you've been doing for... Five months or something and be like, eh, yeah, it's true. I mean, again, I, everyone does the same thing. I mean, personally, right now, I don't know what your weakest matchup is or what you hate the most with the current game, but I literally cannot stand playing versus Zerg right now. I, it's my worst yeah. matchup, and I'm just so I just I'm I'm just tired of playing high high Templar Immortal Charge Lad versus Hydra Bane because that's literally all it is on Korea. It's just Hydra Bane every game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then like I just like lose to it, and when I lose to it, I just want I'm just like, how did I lose to this? Because, like, half the time they'll kill me with banlings, and half the time they'll be on, like, five-minute broodlords, and I'll just be dead. Yeah. So I'm just like, good god. I don't mind playing Kronos. I think if I had this, like, my weakness is probably Terran. Yeah. I just get, like, Elmackered a lot against Terran. Yeah. So, like, when you play, like, a high-level player, it's really yeah. hard to keep up. Yeah. I, my, my opinions on PvZ are, like, or ZBT, and I don't watch much ZBT, but like, sometimes I'll watch ZBT, and I'll be like, man, Terran is unbeatable in this matchup. And then sometimes I'll be like, wow. How does Zerg ever lose? I like I like watch both ends of it. Fun. I'm like yeah, yeah. sometimes I'll see someone and I'll be like, how does Zerg ever lose this? And I'm like, how does Terran ever do it? How does Terran ever lose? <laughs> <laughs> see the thing is, it's so that's why like I wish. I mean, it obviously makes sense that this is not in the game yet because of BlizzCon and all that. But like I wish it was in the game right now. Me too. Because like I want to see what's gonna come up. Like I don't know if PVP like maybe start maybe I shouldn't be opening Oracle. I think I I think you will still want to open Stargate to clear out the Overlords because they can kind of hide everywhere now. But maybe it's going to be more Glaive adept openers because I need stuff to take my third. Or like just maybe just more producing more adepts out of my gateway so I can take my third. Because I do I think, think if I had better. like five four adepts with a battery shield at my third, I think I'd be okay. I, I think so too. I think Stargate is really good still. Yeah. I do like, think. I think you go. I was going to say, I think Stargate's probably going to be the safest open you can possibly do in terms of defensive. Because you can scout with the Stargate, you can defend with the Stargate really easily. Yeah. It's a lot of pressure, like what I just, I just did last game. Yeah. But if you open up anything else, like right. Robo or Gate. Yeah. Ro Robo's kind of in between, but if you open up like Gate heavy to like take your third, I feel like you need to do some type of regression. I think, I, I think Robo is probably the worst just because it doesn't have a good transition. Right? Because like every time I try to open Robo, even though I'm trying to go fast Colossus, like. It's like, what do I do? Go Robo now? Like, do I get an Observer? Because, like, that's the thing, like, if you're not opening Stargate, like, you were kind of thinking Sentry builds would be good, but it's like, when are you really making a bunch of early game Sentries? And then, early game Sentries are a lot of gas, and they kind of can hurt you versus, uh... What about something like a Sentry Blink Stalker timing? Yeah, maybe. Because the only thing that'll kill that, in my opinion, is Drop Lord. Like, if you have, like, uh, Ravager, I think you could micro mm. against that with, like, you know, you, they come in, you force field them, you cut them up. It takes a few seconds for the Ravager shots to break them again if they want to go about doing it that way. Yeah. But if the, if the Zerg decides to go the route of, like, oh, he's got sentries, let me go for uh, drops on his army and, uh, mm. you know, break the, break the, uh, the sentries down, the stalkers will kill them so fucking fast now. Yeah. I think it's mm. scary, man. We'll see. I think. I remember. I remember uh, well, I, just, I was gonna say one more thing. Yeah, I remember sorry. playing with Kiwi Kaki yeah. back in the day in Liberty, and he would always do these fucking Sentry Blink Soccer things. 
and they were some of the hardest fucking builds left right. the whole ever. Right. Because they yeah. were just like, Price controlled. it would pick you apart and it would never stop. He would just keep making more and more yeah. and more stuff. I, I don't know. I I actually, there was a build the hardest too much showing me. No, I mean, there's no sentries, but I think it, it's, uh, I don't know. It's hard. I, I don't know if I agree with that because I think in general, like a lot of these maps, there's not a ton of good force field spots. Like, I, like, it's just hard to get a really nice choke. Like, even on this map, let's say I came, like, to the w north of where my Adept is right now. Like, I can, I'd still need a lot of sentries, and if you just be patient with links, like, I think just pure link can be playing Stalker. I mean, it depends the timing and when I hit. I mean, it also depends, like, I think maybe a 3-base Blink Stalker could have more chance than a 2-base Blink Stalker. I feel like most 2-base builds you can kind of see coming, because I haven't taken a base. But, then again, you don't really expect Blink Stalker, because it's not really in the meta right now, so... Goes both ways. Yeah. The good thing about the bat the shield battery is that you don't need a forge, so you can kind of get. It's not really a cannon, but you can kind of get not some decent damage energy. done with only needing we 75 need minerals uh, to defend bases. Minerals. So it's like okay. Dimensional strength yeah. attuned. I mean, honestly, like especially if I was playing someone cheesy, I would just get battery shields in my mineral field, and I would Give us your and like. I think it's. It, it can really halt a lot of that early link stuff, I think. Like, if I scout it with my first adept, I honestly think I'm in an okay spot. Maybe not, but... Yeah, I really don't think it's that bad. Because, like, they can really heal a lot of my, uh... Oh, God. A lot of my units. Because if I even... Even if I have only, like, two adepts versus, like, ten links, like, by them healing my probes and my... The we are full power. My probes and my adepts, it can be really hard to get damage done with links. But I mean if I have my battery shield. Yeah, yeah. But that's the thing, it's like it's like it's just so new, it's pretty much all theory, because nobody really knows anything. <laughs> Which is kind of when it where, like, when it's the most enjoyable. Yeah, no, it is. Like that's why New York Yes man, it's just so fucking fun. Yeah. Because everyone just like thinks, you know, they're whatever they're thinking is gonna be better than everyone else. Right. And then eventually, someone actually comes onto some shit where it's like actually just game breaking. Yeah. And then people figure out how to beat that. Yeah, that's true. Like I, I all, like the adept when it came out was definitely way too strong. But like the th crazy thing about RTS is like honestly, let's say the adept stayed the way it was, like way overpowered. Like players still would have like adapted and figured out a way to like handle it. Like that's just the way yeah. RTS is. There's always a way to deal with everything. All right. It's just some ways. Some ways give you too many advantages. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Like some ways just force a reaction from a player if they're like a bit strong. Yeah. So that if you do X, your opponent has, has to do Y or they die. Yeah. The thing is, the thing with uh, the thing about the new patch that I think I'm most scared about, but also looking forward to, and, and this is like something I always think about with StarCraft is like, it's. Like I, I not I would never want to be the balance designer because it's just so hard to balance design and know what's right and what's wrong. But like it, it, it's a situation where I think about when Legacy of the Void first came out and uh, oh god okay never mind. I think when Legacy of the Void first came out and I thought to myself like Protoss kind of struggled in the beginning of Legacy of the Void where. It was like Lur it was like Lurker and Ravenger. Protoss didn't really know how to deal with it. And oh, sorry, sorry. Like, the the, the beginning, yeah, yeah. yeah. And I think it, like, I think it's like, yeah, yeah, no. But like at the very beginning, like Protoss didn't really, because like the Colossus got changed, and there were some things that changed the game, the new macro stuff. The game was just different, of course. And Protoss kind of struggled statistically speaking. And but like after a few months, the win rates came around, and Protoss kind of figured it out. And the thing that I am curious about is like, at what point, as a designer, are you like, okay, this is too strong, or are you like, okay, this we just need to give this more time? So I'm like, it's gonna be that scary and interesting spot where it's like, are they gonna take forever to fix things that are actually too strong, or are they gonna let players figure it out? So it's kind of a really scary, exciting early like when it comes out. Like, it, are things gonna be way too broken and not fun, or? Are they going to give people time to figure things out? Need more energy. Yeah, I hope, I hope they don't like patch stuff. Like you know, something cool gets out of the game and they just remove it right away. Right. Oh no, actually, okay, okay. never mind. Yeah, it's more fun if they leave it in for a while. It makes the game more enjoyable, honestly. Yeah. Like, everyone gets like crazy shit to work with. 
Yeah. Right. You're 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 of like the thoughts of it's better. It's definitely better to buff more things than to nerf things all to the previous what they were. Nerfing all the the interesting type of abilities that we put in the game, we're just right. Them. They're broken. Right. It like, makes the game less fun. Yeah, I agree. But I also think that's why one thing I was thinking with Protoss is like I wouldn't mind to see them buffing more Protoss things to deal with Hydra Bane, because when all of Harrowing is buffed for us, right? Yeah. <laughs> but I like I remember the last time they did the major patch last year, and what happened was. They like they were doing. They did a ton of mech changes, although mech didn't even really come to the forefront. But they did a ton of mech changes, really trying to promote mech to make it really, you know, appealing. So like, I almost wouldn't mind seeing overbuffs to force to force new play styles, which is kind of what they did last time, even though mech kind of still didn't happen. But that's kind of what they were going for, in my opinion. But it's like, well, we're gonna really buff this so it looks really good for players. Cause you need cause you need to get something to get like players to stop doing just standard bio stuff or just standard normal stuff. An LD. No, I agree with you. It's more fun that way. Yeah. Oh my god. We are focused. Oh my god! Alright. Holy moly. Well, I mean, we traded out a lot of your festers there. But, the army's kinda weak. <laughs> oh no! Did you even mean to have those three guys in the back? back home. You, have, you have three hydras in the background. No, no, no. That was a total... I didn't even realize I just killed the Templar, I guess. <laughs> no, you oh, didn't. Yeah, no, you didn't. I got a 10 behind. This one I meant to do, but... Hey, are you? I also didn't mean to run into the storm. Then you know. just wipe my army. <laughs> yeah. That turn, that I meant to do that. <laughs> I am not macroing well at all. Protoss, man, are you, what a stupid raise. <laughs> this game, I feel like having like, more minerals. In my nice. day, we might girl. The enemy has discovered <laughs> us. Oh god. I don't really want to go banning, personally. I I I, I hate going banning. It's so yeah. boring. Yeah. That's what I think right now with the current. Uh, I don't know if I needed to recall there, but I did. Yeah, I think this. That's what I think about the current PVZs. Which I just am really bored by the by the meta of the current PVZ, where it's just Hydra Bane. And I'm not saying there's anything wrong with the meta. Like, it, like it, the meta is what it is, and it's not like I. Get, but. Personally, my ability versus her, I feel about it. I definitely have more fun versus other stuff. Yeah, that's just like anything. If you play it over and over and over and over way too much, you'll just be like, yeah. ready for something to now. That's why I'm excited because it's like Colossus could have a chance in, in versus Zerg. Because that, like, that's why the, it's so hard to change, like do changes in this game because like honestly like you would think it's Hydra Bane like you would think Colossus would be like the main part of the meta but it's not so like as a as one of the devs it's like what the hell is going on here not enough minerals yeah I mean if you like honestly like I like think about what I don't like in the game but like I still don't have any good suggestions on what I would even change because I just don't even know we're running out of minerals Oh, I don't know. You have to, that's why you have to just play it and just see what's like, you know, not enough actual... Money, money, money. Well, even in like the normal ladder right now, like I don't even know what I would change. Uh, the whole thing. Scrap <laughs> <Just> it! <laughs> Turn into a MOBA? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> just the storm. <laughs> you know, when I played... Uh, 
When it was the WCS qualifiers for Montreal, I played Cats. And I, you know what happened in that game was I... It was a point in the game that I felt like I was so far ahead. And it was on it was on the mainstream, right? Cause as they always are. So I'm like... So I was starting to feel the pressure where I'm like, man, I bet everyone in chat is wondering how I'm canning has not ended this yet. So then I started thinking about the chat, thinking about me playing. And I was like, Jesus Christ, they're probably all like, Jesus Christ, I said I'm canning again. How is he not ended this? So then I literally pushed across the map thinking there was zero chance I could lose. And then I had like the... I was up like a ton of spy and, I, and then... I don't know, it was the worst throw. Now you know about it. Now I've really yeah. my pain. You're capped out. Time to make some room. Cats is really good at uh nice scrappy games. And stuff. Yeah. Oh, He's kinda like you in a way. You, you guys will do some random stuff that I don't that I don't like. You know, I never fun play, play hit facing either of you. You both you both cats and I have gone through like every phase of Zerg though. Yeah. And there's been phases where like you have to fucking have investor control. Like you're good at you have to be good at it or you die. And uh yeah. Yeah, I don't know. It's an acquired skill. Yeah, it's like, it's so... Uh, Investor is just amazing, man. I love that unit. It's like... Investor and Muta. I love Muta too, but... Muta <laughs> you are talking about a couple things I do not like. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how I feel about this new recall. It does seem good, because I can actually recall any part of my army now. At any time. Yeah. But it's like hard. How do like how do you nerf? How do you change it? Right? Like, I wouldn't even know how to change it. Make the clue. Yeah. It's so hard to know what's right, what's wrong. No. Oh my god. Dude. Balance. Dude, I I literally I literally can't even storm you because it's that you are able to. I think we should block Investor. Oh, yeah, you would. <laughs> this is another one of those games I actually thought I couldn't lose because I was in such a good spot. I mean, I still might not lose. I don't, I don't, I don't know about this one. I was in a pretty good spot, too, man. I have, I have four solid bases, and like 80% of the map coming up for Yeah, you have a lot of creeps, friend. I'll give you that. But I had the... Yeah, I didn't know. I literally couldn't storm because your AoE is so far. I'm going to have to start using Warp Prism. There was one point in the game where it was a little sketchy, where you wiped out. I was like, oh, I meant to do this. Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We <laughs> traded armies, I guess, at that north side. Guys are exhausted. <sighs> no. Zerg broken. That's what I'm getting at. broken. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, it's like the range on those puppies. Okay. Can we... Can, can, let me... I'm bringing the High Templar to the middle of the map. Bring it in faster. I want to see the range. Unburrow it. Okay? We're running out of yeah, I'm bringing it to the middle of Kareep. It's, well, it's even better now than it was before, because even before, Infestors could outrange the feedback. Yeah. But now it's like, and it's like, yes, it's a slow, yeah. but it's like still like nuts. I'm in the middle. Okay, don't move, don't move, don't move. I'll, I'll show you max range bundle, okay? Okay, I don't have enough storm right now, but yeah. Yeah, that's okay. This, this right here is maximum range. Wait, can you unburrow? I can't even see it. It's not even on my screen. It's gonna be off screen. It's gonna be off screen. Oh, it's like over. Okay. Well, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna move it. I'm, I'm doing the very edge of where it's gonna hit you. Okay. Right now. Boom, right there. So now, oh you can move toward me and see where it can hit you from. Yeah. Mineral field. I. All right, wait. Let me get, let me get, let me get a little health back and then do it again. So I'm gonna try to storm you. Back home. Okay. You ready? I'm not gonna say I'm macroing up behind this, but I might be. <laughs> I'll be straight. I'll, yeah, that's okay. okay. I'll be straight to your left and then. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm ready. I can fungle me. All right. Okay, yeah, I can never touch you, cause like that—that's the edge of my storm. Oh my god! Just take him. Just take him. Oh wait a minute, that auto attack. Now you're done. <laughs> just to, just get this guy out of my face. He's on your team now. Just keep him. Oh my god. Good Christ. That is actually. That is gonna make Sky Toss really bad, I feel like, with Infestors being that dangerous. I mean, they've always been. I don't know. If you have enough carriers, though, I can kind of still wipe you. If I get the nice engagement on the Infestor. I have cancer on lockdown. My supply won't even drop 40. You take that back. I'm confident. You take that back. I, like. I don't even know what to do. I, I, I already feel like I'm dead and I'm maxed. <laughs> <laughs> okay, 
Daddy, that's where I want you to be. <laughs> that's the feeling I was looking for. Oh my Mineral God. field depleted. I mean, okay, let me get rid of some of these boys. I mean, let me do not get rid of these, some of these boys. Let's keep my entire army. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, I'm just trying to clear up creep. Please don't engage. Your upgrade's done. Hey, I like that creep. I worked really hard on that. Don't you dare neuroparasite this mothership. She's new and she's gonna have a skin soon, so let her live. <laughs> what are you gonna do about it? <laughs> Dude, my Templar is already like. Should I just give them to you before the fight starts? Yes. I think that would be a wise choice. Vespian dies are exhausted. You wanna know something crazy? I'm not even kidding. I think I could beat your army without Hydra. I might be a little over eager. Don't say that to me. I, without the Hydra. I'm the, it's nothing about you. I know, I know, I know, I know, of course. You're, you're it's done. Oh, vibe taking shots. I'm unfollowing him. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, I feel like with this new Parabomb and, and Static Defense and Infestor, I don't even need the Hydra. Really. It's like, they're, they're just like an afterthought. They like come in and clean, they're the cleanup crew. <laughs> oh my God. Let's just wipe up the pieces. From the shadows, I come. Alright. Don't do this. What's the Zerg stream? This is Twitch TV slash Bible. You killed my I was laughing at me. Did I? It looks like it's still on the map for me. How many If I if you were to just, you know, just talk in your stream, how many corruptors do you have per se? Corruptors? Yeah. Do you, any? You can't warp in there. None. Okay. Just just you know, just wondering I, for no real reason. I don't like corruptor. Upgrade complete. Yeah, base corruptor. You're at Ooh, I just thought of something sexy. Absolutely sexy is what I thought. Hey, 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 keep this creep back. No, no, no. Whoa! Give him back to me. That is. T I got a Nexus! Stop this. No, you don't! Keep him. Freaking traitor, dude. Are you kidding me? I, like, saw it coming, but I couldn't stop myself from letting it happen. You can't warp in there. What if I just turn this into a massive stalemate, though, where you can't actually... I'm just gonna not let you attack me. At all. Hold on. I will force it. Oh, yeah? We're running out of Your DCs home. are really annoying. You can't warp in there. Oh, how'd they get there? I didn't even see them. You're maxed out. Good job never skipping uh, like that. From the how is this possible? Whoa! What is with the mutes here? My supply is really getting freed up right now because only nobody's perfect. You can't worry about them. Uh, the thing about these mutas, dude. Let's like seriously, no. You can't warp that's not there. cool. That's 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 low even for you. It's not like them. Okay. Mm. Battle is upon us. Man, DTs are kind of nuts. Have you thought about that? Can you kill those DTs? I'm trying to uh, snipe some buildings in your main right now. There you are. I'm coming back. No, don't no, 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 dude. I, d I told you I was coming. I told you I was gonna do that. You can't go for him now. I'm thinking about letting this game never end so you can never play pubs. Thoughts? No, no you're gonna. You see the the slow crawl death. I honestly, exactly. this is at your front door. I don't care. I got a bunch of battery shields. Let me see, let me see, watch my boys go to work here. I don't know if I'm going to work here, but watch them go to work. Whoa! That's very realistic to change You didn't kill anything, dude. 
Like the, I don't think the fungal hits air. I, you didn't even kill anything. <laughs> Look, my chat will tell you, you didn't kill any interceptors there. That's all I know. That's all I'm going to tell you about that. Hey, buddy, back up. Uh, oh, money storm. Let's go. That was fucking. That was pretty good. Six. Yeah. You you can only dream about a storm like that. The thing is, my army composition is kind of really. I wish I had some like tempest or something. We'll have to replay this another time and see what the different late game comps would be here. Like if te like uh, tempest doesn't even seem that good. Oh yeah. Oh my god, I tried to overcharge my pylon. <laughs> You're engaging the opponent. Juicy. Dude. That's toxic. Honestly? You must Stop so toxic, man. Hey, your base is Dude, my battery shields. Come on. Stop that. No. That's fine. Take them. Hey, you want those? There you go. You're welcome. The thing about the crazy thing about this is, like, I could have had those, but I didn't even really want them. You know, Tempest would be horrible here, wouldn't they? We require more minerals. We're gonna find out. Good God. You Zergs make me sick. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. I'm never playing the PTR again. <laughs> I'm fucking done. I'm out. <laughs> You're not even 3 3 on your Hydras. Oh. I don't tw need it. Twitch chat. No, I don't care if you need it now. Let's balance wine. <laughs> good God. Your base is under attack again. Okay, this is good. Because I had too many workers. The thing about this is. You know, this is good for my. Look at all the battery shields. I just want to get some units here to see what. No. No. No! I have no vision. Can you fall back for a little bit? Thank you. Hmm. Where is my damn vision? Boys, what's going on here? Dimensional strings. Empty. Surprise, baby! Uh oh. Uh oh. Episode two: The can strikes back. Okay. Protoss is most OP race in the game, says my chat. I mean, are you seeing this? You think you think I ever lose to Vibe if the game is balanced? Are you kidding me? You hear that? <laughs> the thing is, you haven't you haven't calculated in the High Templar auto attack damage. That's where I'm gonna that's where I'm gonna come back. Oh my God, where are my obses though? You can't warp in there. I mean, I got, I got, I got tons of, I got detection on deck here, baby. Maybe Tempest are good. We're running out of minerals back home. They're going after your pylon. Uh, there's a viper in the middle. Thank you. A lot of your creep and spore crawlers are kind of going down here. Yeah. Oh, I yeah, I've submitted my combo here. This is starting to look good uh, for me. Am I wrong? Is, you know, we require more minerals. No, you're wrong. <laughs> I think those hydras are looking fairly well. We shall spatter the darkness. The threads of place so gas expensive to do this. Holy shit. Yeah. 
Wow, you're capped out. Time to make some Your warriors have engaged the other shadows. I mean, I still have a really hard time with my fungals right now. Are you near me? I'm deciding if I need to use my revelation. <laughs> that sounds like a yes. The threads of fate lie bare. Where are you? We interpret. I don't like the my base. I don't want to let that. I don't believe that for a second. No, I needed that. Can I have him back? Only if you don't kill my base, I'm not. It's out of my control. I mean, of course I won't. Okay, now I want him back. Thank you. Thank you. Hmm. Oh look, he's back already. What a kind soul. What? Where are those muse going? No! Mm. I'm lagging wicked bad, that's crazy. I have migrated to your bottom south, by the way. I know you have. And I don't like it. One bit. <laughs> it's kind of roomy down here. I wish I spawned on you. What do you do? What are these hydras doing? It is destined. Our fates are That was actually pretty good. Where are you going? <laughs> Why are you coming back to? <laughs> I'm spooked. Oh, yeah, right. Oh my God! Your probes are under attack. Boys, find them. Wait a minute. You require more Vespine gas. Hold my finger, Artosis. <laughs> it's so fun. This is actually really weird. I'm not expecting to beat that army. <laughs> I start winning. Yeah, I also was not expecting you. I think I mean, I'm still going to win now, I think. Yeah, I think we're You know what I think? I think Hydras are actually outdated. Are what? You know what? They're outdated, man. Oh, yeah? I think I should actually use the best of We're running out of minerals back That is honestly not a bad idea, because you know what happened during that fight? Bigger, was I couldn't upgrade. actually um, focus down your your uh, your infestors. Because like, I had your infestors revealed, but I couldn't focus them down because of the fungal on my interceptors. It made them so slow that I actually wasn't even attacking you. And I couldn't yeah. kill them right away. So it actually was an interesting spot. I think if I actually, I don't know, it's weird. I think I might actually go Ultra and Fester with most folks yeah. heavily on uh, Intensive Terran against Kytos. Yeah, I, I think you got, it, it's interesting. You know, it depends how many Ultras you go. Because that could be kind of... I, would, I, don't, I don't think a lot would work very well. Yeah, you, like need to be, you need to be the right number. Because if you had too many, then your air would be too weak. But I think Infester Viper will get a lot done. Right, because you didn't have any vipers in that last fight. No, I'm fine. Yeah. yeah. GG's. Yeah. I don't know, like, the Hydra, it does 15 damage, and then uh, it does attack a little bit faster than an Infestitarian. Yeah. But an Infestitarian hits air for 17 damage a shot, and it hits, still hits more than one time per second. Yeah. It has like an attack speed of, like, 0.9. Yeah, it depends. It, yeah, you, yeah, especially if you have a lot of Infestors, but... You can't you can't throw an Infestor Terran out if you're knurling, I think, right? No. So but you have to time it up right. I, I would have like twenty infestors or like twenty. Yeah. Infestors. Oh yeah. If you if you replace the hydras with more infestor. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. yeah and okay. then you just would it, like have some. Yeah. Else's and life. then if I rec so, tried to recall, you'd have so many neuraled already that I would just, I would you just kill everything anyway. Yeah. Because the the ultras would just like shove like ultra high and temps. would just shove the templar and then you would just 
Yeah. Fucking mass temple or uh, infested terrain with neural. It sounds. No, it sounds good. I I still don't good. know if you need the high temps. I think skipping corruptors was definitely correct. You didn't need corruptors at all there. Um, but I think. Right, cause, I mean, the High Templar is definitely... Like, you would have killed me if I didn't have High Templars in that last fight. Right, I got some storms on your Hydras. But... Yeah. Uh, yeah, I mean, if even if it was just no Hydras and pure Infestor, more or less. I mean, you kind of need the Hydras to have a little bit of a buff... Be a little bit of a buffer, though. I guess that would be the Ultras. They'd be the buffer. Yeah, I mean, if you kill the storms there, I guess you probably do win that. Right? If you did have, like, three Ultras to kill the storms, then you probably would have won that. Because yeah. I really had a really hard time killing your Infestors with the fungal, whether it was the neural making my army really weak, but I like shift Q your infester like three times before they actually died. Yeah. And I think what it was, was my interceptors were just so slow to the fungal that I couldn't actually kill you very quickly. Yeah. 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 Uh, it's, it's, it, like, I definitely think I lost that game though from the, uh, the prisms. You fucking oh actually, yeah, that's true. I killed your bases. Yeah, I ran out of money again. Yeah. I mean, I thought you could have I mean, taken the bottom bases a little quicker, but <laughs> I was so broke, man. Yeah. I was like, when you were like uh, pushing and shit, I had like no money. I mean, honestly, as well, was I think I, you did kind, of, you kind of hurt you too. Was when I recalled to my one base and I, and I was able to instantly kill like ten hydras. I mean, that didn't hurt you that bad, but it's it ch kind of changed the momentum when you had when you were killing my three, two bases there. <laughs> no, it's really good because I don't even know you're recalling there. Until, right, like, it's instant. Disappear. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. I do think right now the strongest thing Protoss seems to have is recall both recalling to bait. I guess recalling to bases to defend and just recalling units because you can recall any group of units anytime so it is really good yeah. right because you find yourself in a tough spot like maybe you did a huge warp into the main and they're there you could just try to recall it's a long cool i mean a two minute cooldown is long but it's also not that i mean over the course of a game it kind of is long because if you think about a game's only 15 minutes maybe you may only have one or two recalls depending on the timing and what you do yeah it's uh, it, it, it's definitely more powerful than I thought defensively. Yeah. How you were saying that's like just a good defensive tool. I have never had someone just like recall a whole fucking. Food. Right, because it takes so long. Like, oh shit. Right, because yeah, I I I'm 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 in favor of it though, right? Because it's because I think with the recall too, they they're trying to, it's gonna help PVT where, Terrans doom drop you in your base and before you know with the mothership core now you can't really handle you need to have more stuff now you can just kind of recall everything to your main, and it'll be instant. Yeah. So that's kind of, I think, I mean, I think it's fairly well thought out, but it's still so early to tell on so many different things. I do think the Infestor seems to be much stronger than I was even really, when the, like, when the changes happened, I didn't even really realize the Infestor was even different, but I think it's really good. Probably yeah, the best I, thing I've seen from Zerg right now is the Infestor. Yeah, that's, I like, like, the fact that you can fungal air again, I think it's still really good now. Yeah. When you couldn't fungal air, that was pretty rugged. Was pretty, yeah. I think I gonna be it's going to be, the whole game's kind of crazy now, actually, because mutas might become a lot less seen if the stalkers are that much stronger at dealing with them. Right? Because it felt I like... You can still go better, but you have to have adrenal links with them. If you don't yeah, have yeah, links... Yeah, yeah, them, yeah. Because the links would kill stalkers, especially... Well, they would kill stalkers, but stalkers three-shot links instead of four-shot now, like, at the base. At the very base level, they do. So... I, I feel like there's a lot of links though. You're, it's sensitive. Yeah, right, trading with stalkers. You're still gonna have a lot of overkill. And, like, well, you're gonna have like maybe like six stalkers shoot a, a link because you can't like have every single group of three stalkers focus fire their own them. You know. Yeah, that's true. But so if, you, if you if you went to stalker storm and then we're using stalker battery shield to defend your bases, because right now when I see mutas, I still go stargate as an answer. That one game I just wasn't prepared. Usually, usually I go phoenix to handle stargate, but now the new stalkers are better at killing things from the sky, which I think is kind of the way it was in Brood War, where Dragoons could kind of deal with things like that, although I don't really know Brood War, but... Uh, Brood War, when you just pick Corsairs, you're like, well... Oh, yeah, that's true, Corsairs. That's bad. true, actually, yeah. Alright, man. Uh, I don't want to hold you forever, but I really appreciate playing, man. It's so much more fun no, than just fun, grinding yeah. by myself. I, I agree. It was way more fun. For sure. Play another time. Definitely. Any, every, every, I get on, like, when I asked you every single day, so... Anytime you're on, you come into my chat or anything, I'll too. I'll play for sure. I'll try to play, but you get on so late for me. Yeah, I know. I get on late for everybody. I get on late for Pig, and yeah. he's in Australia. <laughs> well, I'm in Australia right now too. Oh yeah, that's right. That's right. That's true. All right, man. Have fun. Thanks for joining yeah, us. Later, a heart yeah, to Pig, guys. Too. But uh, yeah, a lot of fun, man. Hopefully, you have a nice rest of your stream. Oh yeah, you too, man. Later, bro. Later, man. Woo! That was fun. That was fun, man. I had a lot of fun doing that. I don't know if you guys enjoyed that. 
let Vibe know, hey man, thanks for playing with us, because that definitely was enjoyable. I, it's just fun, you know, theorizing, thinking about the game, playing new new stuff. It, it's just fun. I, I just have a lot of fun with all of it, really. It's, uh... Yeah, I really enjoyed myself, man. Gotta give some love. I didn't give any shout-outs. Usually I'll mute my mic and give some shout-outs. I don't know if you guys are even here, but I appreciate 